When people ask me what to do about changing school food, I mean, how do we start? What are the things that we can do? One of the first things, of course, is get our group of friends together, the other parents, our committee, our task force, whatever we want to call ourselves, but working as a group. And there's a number of things we can do. We could start with gardens. We could do salad bars. We could say no chocolate milk, because of course it's soda and drag. We could say we should stop selling junk food in vending machines. But pick one thing. Pick the one thing that's most important and most egregious in your school. I mean, if we have ice cream for desserts in schools, that's a big thing. We should not have ice cream. We should not have chocolate milk. We should not be feeding our kids sugar. So look around, volunteer in your school, look at all the different things, do a little assessment, and pick the first worst thing. Pick one thing. Don't try and do 10 things at once. Pick one thing, and whether it's something really bad you want to get out or really good you want to get in, work on that. Start thing by thing, one thing at a time, and you'll find that you can make change. And once one thing changes, you can change another. So maybe you get a salad bar, maybe you get a garden, and you get rid of the chocolate milk, and you get rid of the high fructose corn syrup, and you get rid of the trans fats, and wow, maybe you could have organic something or hormone and antibiotic free beef, but it's one thing at a time, just keep walking down that road. And you'll see that in the end, after five years or 10, maybe your kids will be out of school, but you'll be able to make the change.